Hey there, on the Sao Cal playing Rakugaki Mario, and last time we went here, you know, we went through the poison. A Japanese ROM hack from the olden days will have a level with poison. That's just the law. A castle that trembles. I wonder why prison. Normally, I, I try to look through the. Oh, the music is excited. It's a very funky remix of a certain song from Mario Brother. Oh, whoa, geez. Okay, uh, I can deal with that type of layer too, Schne. Timer's not super long. Yeah, I, uh, I play that bad. It's fine. Uh, I'm a. Okay. Not what I expected. Oh, boy. You know what? Uh, farb. Oh, there's blues! I got got! <laughs> I totally got got! Okay, I'm loving this. Yeah, we just. Okay, see, let's us see the whole end. I don't know. I'm. One day, I'm gonna play Rom Hack, and something silly is gonna happen in the scene, and I'm gonna happy I see it. It's probably not this game, but I don't wanna take a chance. So you just kind of vaguely jump when it's not there. Like, it's it, it moves pretty quickly, and it's pretty scary. But, like, the secret is that, yeah, like, it's pretty simple. Just jump while it's not there. That's basically all you have to do. And here, you get a secret floor. And then here, you're like, uh, like that. You know, we gotta panic a little bit. If you hear some background sounds, my apologies. Uh, okay. Ooh, the jump didn't jump! I was oh, I'm- okay. See, there- yeah, there I'm jumping too early at that point. I got overconfident. Uh, yeah, that- hmm. Like, I'm not sure what I did that time where I just kind of sailed over it. Oh man, I'm so glad I have the blue switch, though. It's so nice! Like, getting a tangible reward for- Dang it! What? Really? Oh, I'm okay. I did it the first time super easily there. And since then, I feel like I just don't really know. This is something. All right, okay. Uh, oh boy. Doing this, huh? Okay. I'm gonna let you dance. If your friends don't dance, hey, that's good for them, you know? No, what? Okay, so... I guess there, my crime was I tried to haul two up, so that... Because, like, you don't follow with a vine, right? Like, you stay at your own XY coordinate, and so, yeah, by trying to hold on to the top of the vine, as soon as it moved down, I could not hold on to it anymore, which is why I fell basically instantly. Like, although human instincts would dictate that, oh, I want to hold on to as high as possible, that is, in fact, an error. You want to be, like, holding it around the middle. Well, I'm probably just gonna die here. Yeah, see... I mean, most places, if I die... It's falling in the lava, so... Like, I guess it doesn't really matter. Like, I mean, there are enemies everywhere, still, but... Like, mid, there you go. That's what you want. Skeleton with a bone. Ah, that's a description. Oh, well, whatever. Should've just spun jumped then. What the, 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 ah, there goes there. Skeleton. So now we're at where the thwomps are. No! I'm trying to control and it's really not. Like, I'm... No! You can't... You can't spin jump off of the vine. I tried to spin jump there, it didn't do. I forgot, like, I had to try, but I forgot that rule. Alright, I'm here big. I don't think that is meaning... <sighs>
All right, well, I'm here big, so... I can just tank through it. Hey, that's where the midpoint was all this time. Ah, oh, that's just frustrating. Yeah, well, I guess I kept dying out of the midpoint. And yeah, like, I never learned what I needed to do. All I did was get here... big already. Like... I just tanked it. Yeah, I still don't understand, really, what... What was desired? Like, I don't know. Like, I'm... Oh, sh no. Bad, 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 bad me. Playing badly. I don't know. I feel like at some point I went inside my own head and I just... I'm making really weird decisions. You can go in a pipe. It's fine. That's why it's there. Alright, so... More of the same, but this time it's auto-scrolling, so... Act confidently. Cause yeah, like more often than not, you'll see a setup and bunk your head. No, see a setup and like you'll have to act the second time you see it, basically. Ah, well, you know what? It's fine. Yeah, like this is a, a okay. Yeah, you do that. That's really cool, actually. Like getting close to them, going upward. It's pretty nice. Okay, I'm gonna see it again. Like ah, uh, I. Like, this guy, I don't know, like, it, that guy just... Ah, uh, uh, okay. There was a lot of luck there. So here you gotta time yourself, like, way early. Alright, let's just go and go. Just go and go. Yeah, you see it once, act on the second time. Oh, that one's different. No, it's just that. It's just not there for longer. That one, you're better off just going over entirely. That one, I'm willing to wait a little bit more. It's there. See, it's, you need to act... ...as soon as you know it exists, almost. This is one of those. This is an auto-scroll where you're playing in, like, the... ...front third of the screen. <laughs> So here is where I'm gonna wait, and the jump's not gonna jump, ruining my plan. No! Well, technically speaking, being small is good. Uh, this, this was luck. Um, no! I jumped way too early. I this is a mace. Yep. Yeah. Oh. I barely made it there. No, 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 no. I knew it. No. Alright, well, I just kind of went. No real timing. No real understanding. Just wenting. Like, that feels so bad. It was. Oh boy. Uh, I can just skip these plans, though. Thank you, Blue Block. You're pretty good. No! I did jump! Why am I having so much trouble with... Yay. That feels, I mean, feels like luck, but the reality is because this is a pretty slow auto scroller, as long as I always jump at the exact same time, I'm always gonna have the exact same result, right? Alright, so. 
There we go. Just do that. Uh, okay. This is... Zoop. There we go. You make this rip sound, it's important. It's Raznor! Ever hear about Raznor? He has a big mouth. And he snores. Probably. I, he has that look. You know, that body type of an animal that snores. Maybe? I, I shouldn't assume, I don't know. Maybe they whistle. Sleep whistling? Probably worse. I like this level! Like, yeah, it gave me some issues here and there, but, I mean, I like this level! It's not free, like, it's not the easiest thing in the world, but I feel like it respects you. You know, and it's just, it's a decent challenge. I'm going to guess that the author is one of the actual Japanese ROM hack authors that made that level. I'm starting to get a vibe for... There's definitely a different vibe between levels made by old guard Japanese ROM hack that came back for this project versus fans of ROM hacks of the era making homages to levels of that era. There's a very different vibe between the two. This feels definitely like one of the former, though I can be wrong. Uh, I think I will be cook- yeah, I'll go to Cookie Mountain in between this session and the next. That just makes sense, I think.